Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5. Starting at number 5. Red Cat Racing Everest. The Everest 10 has a single motor mounted in the center of the chassis. It utilizes telescopic drive shafts to deliver power to the front and the rear axles, allowing the suspension to articulate at the same time. Two aluminum beadlock rings hold the big, aggressively chunky tires firmly in place on the wheels. This negates the need to use glue to hold the tires in place. A NIMH battery is included in the box. All of the important electronics are protected by waterproof casings so fording the occasional creek or stream, while navigating your obstacles is not an issue. When not rock crawling, the Everest 10 moves at a steady walking pace, but you won't see much in the way of speed. And the turning circle is huge. This isn't a problem outside, but if you drive it indoors expect to do some extensive forward and reverse maneuvers. Coming at number 4. Steam Prime Remote Control. The Steam Prime is a higher-end scale rock crawler that is best suited for those who know they will love having a rock crawler. It is not the kind of vehicle you buy on the off chance your child might like one. At 12. 56 inches long, 5. 28 inches high, and 8. Two modes of transformation The fast remote control car has two modes. The on-road to flat terrain and high-speed performance and the off-road for rugged terrain that allows the car to climb over obstacles. Transformable body makes the car more flexible and offers a better climbing ability to conquer any terrain easily and stably. Let children cultivate a spirit of courage to challenge and accompany them to grow up healthily and happily. Two operating modes, this RC stunt car comes with four-wheel drive. Front and rear dual motors provide strong power torque to move on any terrain easily and stably, and reaches 9 to 12 miles per hour for an exciting driving experience. At number 3. Dirk de 45 RC. The DEE RC Rock Crawler is a reasonably well-built example of a toy-grade remote control vehicle that is suitable for younger kids. It is sturdy enough to take some rough and tumble play, but doesn't cost so much that you don't want to let the kids play with it. Chunky rubber tires, big wheels, and shock absorbers make this rock crawler capable of tackling uneven surfaces with up to a 45-degree angle. The metal, scratch-resistant body panels mean it will maintain a like-new appearance even after the occasional rollover. The controller is a 2. You turn the vehicle on and it builds up to a top speed of approximately 4 miles per hour and stays there until you hit the brake. This can be frustrating when navigating some obstacles. The scratch-resistant metal shell can effectively prevent damage caused by crashes and protect the electronic components inside the body. We recommend wiping the car shell before storing it to ensure the durable using. Number 2 of my list. Danchi Ridge Rock. Partway between hobby grade and toy, the Danchi Ridge Rock is an excellent entry-level RC rock crawler for beginners. There are plenty of adjustable components so your child will not grow out of it quickly as they become more experienced. This model has just over 3 inches of ground clearance which makes it capable of navigating a wide range of obstacles. You can easily swap steering modes between front-wheel steering, rear-wheel steering, four-wheel steering, or four-wheel crab steering. The batteries take approximately five hours to fully charge if you are using the USB charger included with the crawler and connecting it to a computer, battery bank, or USB outlet plug. The Ridge Rock comes with a rechargeable battery pack for the vehicle, a USB charging cable, and a pistol grip style remote. The battery bay is large enough for you to upgrade the batteries at a later date if you wish. The remote requires three AA batteries which are not included. And number 1. Axial SCX24. This officially licensed Jeep Wrangler RC rock crawler from Axial is everything you look for in a larger vehicle but in a small, well-formed package. The chassis has C-channel steel frame rails with bracing. 
The motor mount is also made from steel, keeping flex to a minimum and minimizing the potential of damage to the gears. A jumper on the receiver allows you to choose one of two brake options, either brake or instant reverse. The controller lets you choose between a low, medium, and high-speed setting. There's no option to switch between four and two-wheel drive. You have permanent 4WD, but it does have four-link rear suspension. Extra links are included should you want to adjust the length of your wheelbase. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.